In this video, I'll be going through all six of the L cases. So for the first L case, this one here, you may notice that it has headlights, but the important part is actually this 2x1 bar here. So when, when we see the 2x1 bar, we want to hold it at the front, like this. And because the bar is on the right-hand side of the cube, we want to use our right hand for this algorithm. Uh, this one's actually a fairly simple algorithm. It's actually F, double sexy, F prime. So the next case is the mirror of the previous one. Once again, we want to look for bars here. So this is two by one bar. We want to, we want to put at the front. And after we put it at the front, we notice that it's towards the left of the cube. So we could use this algorithm. It's basically the mirror of the previous algorithm starts off with an F prime and two sexies on the left and then we finish off with an F. However, for the same case, if we're right-handed, we could use a different algorithm for it and it could ultimately be faster. So holding it once again, the bar at the front and to the left, we could use our right hand and do R prime, U prime and then two sledgehammers and then finish off. So moving on to these L shapes, uh, these ones also have headlights, but once again, they're not too important. The important parts are the three by one bar. So the rest of the four L cases all have this three by one bar. And whenever you see a three by one bar on one of these L cases, always hold it to the left. That goes for all of them. So for this one, we want to hold it to the left. And now we want to check out the L where the L is sitting. So it's sitting at the back, which actually means we want to use the front part here. So our algorithm wants to deal with the front part of the cube. So it goes like this. So for this L case, once again, we want to hold the 3 by one bar always to the left. And we want to see where the L shape is sitting. So this time it's sitting near the front which actually means we want to do the algorithm so it deals with the back part of the cube. So the algorithm goes like this. So finally, these L cases. So these L cases don't have headlights, but they have this 3x1 bar on the left. Make sure that's always on the left. And we have another 2x1 bar here at the front. So once again, this 3x1 bar always has to be on the left. And next, we want to check out where the 2 by one bar is. So this algorithm can be a little hard to remember. So how I remember it is the first two moves should bring this 2 by one bar to this position here. So it goes like this. And that brings it here. And then that should be enough to trigger your muscle memory to remember the rest of the algorithm. So for our final L case, we have this one here. Once again, as always, 3 by one bar always towards the left, and we check out the headlights. There's no headlights, which means that there must be another 2 by one bar here. So this time it's at the back. So uh, this algorithm, pretty similar to the previous one, um, but it's also pretty hard to remember as well. So we could remember it the same way by bringing this 2 by one bar to this position here in the first two moves, like this. And that should be enough for you to remember the rest. So that's it for the six L cases, hope you learnt a thing or two, and uh, thanks for watching.